it, everybody? It's Mike Love. I'm here. I just got this uh, new beautiful lady in the in the mail from my friend uh, Michael Bile, who's a, a friend of mine, an amazing builder, um, and he built this guitar for me, and I've just been playing it over the last couple days, and it's just such an incredible instrument. I wanted to share it with you guys and uh, just talk a little bit about it. I met Michael a few years ago uh, when he was working for PRS. He worked for PRS for a long time and uh, at the time he uh, he invited me to the shop and I I, I was in town uh, on the East Coast playing a gig over there and, and, uh, and went down to the shop and checked out some of his, his guitars and uh, just kind of had my mind blown, you know. I've played a lot of really nice guitars over the years, working at a music shop, and uh, and these guitars kind of stood out to me as as something really special. And uh, the thing that I loved most about them is uh, just their ability to handle dynamics and also the balance the balance of them. And so uh, Michael kind of built this guitar. Uh, out of our relationship and, and talking about, uh, you know, the guitars that, that I've really been into of his since then. And, and um, I've been really excited about it since then. You know, he, he left PRS and, and started his own uh, really small custom shop. And um, uh, I'm really happy to be playing one of the one of the guitars that he's built in this first year that he's been uh, doing it. And yeah, it's just a... thing is that uh, the low end is really rich but not boomy it's very very focused so I could you know still do all of my reggae stuff nothing gets muddy uh, and then the mid-range is really to me where uh, this guitar and so many others that he's built kind of stand out. A lot of guitars tend to be either thin in the mid-range or honky in the mid-range and that's I think uh, really one of the most important elements of an acoustic guitar as it fills out that range if you're playing in an ensemble and uh, uh, you know it's just got a really full <laughs> note stands out on its own and and is really full and fills out and complements each other and then you know even up in the high register notes are really really thick and full-bodied So dig in. It just gets insanely loud without getting choked at all. And it's just like that amount of dynamic that you can get from an instrument. insane you know I mean I I don't know that I've ever played an instrument with with that much dynamic level so I've just been loving playing this guitar and and really really enjoying it it's, it's been a dream for me so I just wanted to uh, I'm about to put a pickup in it and start using it live in my shows so you'll see me playing it live in my shows I'm really excited about that uh, having an instrument uh, you know that's kind of been built to to what I need and with the idea of what I need out of it in mind it's it's kind of I think every musician's dream so I'm so thankful for it and I'll just share a little bit of bit of music all right so this is a tune from my last album love overflowing this one's called sweet sound <laughs> Thank you. 
sorrows And wearing my heart out on my sleeve All I need is this love in my heart